Who <laughs> <laughs> called my name, cuz? I hear I have caused mad harm. But you crazy, dog. I would never be suspected you. No need for a brawl in these streets, man. No fun, no scrap. Hey, you see that Romeo can pack this heat. <laughs> what happened here, mister? Alright, officer, so this one went down. I saw this sketchy guy roll up the street and he rolled down his window like, I don't know if I saw this guy and he goes like, Braca, Braca. <laughs> it was all mad and saying, yo, better control all these streets. Uh, sure, well, citizen, now can you give me a description of the criminal? Sure thing. White male, blue bandana on his head looking like Tupac. Killer eyes, really sharp jawline that could probably cut diamonds. Main man of the crime is Romeo. They call him Archer. Uh, thank you. Now, if you ever see our training, please call Crime Stoppers. They say, they, they say he's the son of a rich gang named the Monte Blunt. I'll be on my way. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I wish the sun would hurry up and set. If only the gods would chase it away and bring the dark clouds, dark cloudy night immediately. There, Romeo can come to me quick. He's dead. Who is, nurse? Your cousin Tibble, he's dead. And Romeo is kicked out of this town for he has done, for what he has done to him. How could such a handsome and perfect man do such a crime like this? Where's my brandy? I'm sick of this hood nonsense. <laughs> Romeo should be ashamed of himself. Ah, nurse, take all these chocolates and throw them away. Return all the seven Versace bags I received as a last gift from my love. Go back to your room, Juliet. Rest now, so I can go find your Romeo. I bet you would. You, I bet you that your father roared his church. Here, when you t when you find him, give him this piece of gum to remind him of the way I always cut gum out of him instead. <laughs> oh my God! Scene three: Jackson as Romeo. Arch as Fire Lawrence, Marco as Nerd. Hey, yo, Zog, I'm leaving this place, man. Yo, Father Lawrence, thanks for the help, man. I appreciate it. I've lost my rep in this town already, anyways. Going so soon, Son of God? Just because you're being sent out of the country, at least be optimistic. Optimistic? What is there to be optimistic about? If I can't spend the rest of my life happy with my girl, Juliet? I'll help you deal with it. Philosophy, the remedy for trouble shall come for you, even though you are banished. Damn philosophy! <laughs> Shush, child. There's someone at the door. Romeo, it's Juliet. Oh, she says nothing, sir. She just c cries and cries and falls on, her, falls on her bed and gets up again and calls out Tibble's name, and then calls out your name, and then falls on the bed again. Romeo, please get up. <laughs> You're alive and be happy for that. You're lucky the death penalty has been changed to exile. Julia is alive, my brother. In the name of the Lord, my guide, may the God bless you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Father. My gang soul is fulfilled. Amen to that, my brother. I will go and hit up my girl, Julia. Before you leave, sir, Julia has given you a reminder of her, a piece of her chewed up gum. Thank you. God bless you, sister. <laughs> Scene 4, Brayden as Lord Capulet, Sava as Paris. Hey yo my guy, I'm mad excited. Oh, hey yo my guy, this is Thursday tomorrow, cuz I'm mad, I'm mad excited for this marriage. Pete. Yeah, I'm mad excited too. Tell Juliet uh, that, get Juliet prepared and tell her when the marriage is. Scene 5, Aaron as Juliet, Jackson as Romeo, Salva as Mother Capulet, Graydon Father Capulet, Marco, Nurse. Oh, Romeo! <laughs> <laughs> Archie, do you have to go? Yes, Juliet, baby. I, I have to leave. But I don't, I don't care if the popo chases me down. I will live till the end. 
Well, I'm saying, you're so brave. I love it. <laughs> Mmm, girl, it's morning, yo. Day is about to be lit. <laughs> I don't want to go. I say leave. Mama and Papa Capricorn gonna catch you. The morning getting lighter and lighter, yo. Lighter and lighter while our sorrow grows darker and darker. Peace out, cuff. <laughs> but one last kiss. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my word. <laughs> Aaron feels abused. <laughs> How are you, Jenna? <laughs> my bear was trash, Mama. Happy cut. Why did Sable have to pass away? Because of that punk rum, y'all. But don't worry, Juliet. Uh, we catch that crook one day. Coco will handle it. Anyway, is that good news? Next Thursday morning, uh, you'll be married to pretty boy rich kid Harry. Why? I want, I won't marry him. His breath stinks and his body smells. Tell Papa Cappy Crip I ain't marry him. Don't you dare trace me in a farce of marriage. Archie! <laughs> he sounds like Jimmy Fallon as like a fan. 